Welcome guys, Matt here. In this video, I'm gonna show you the best cowbell. The absolute best cowbell in the world. I think I finally found it. All right guys, so I know cowbells get a bad rap sometimes, and there are some bad cowbells in the world. There's some cowbells that we don't want on our drum kit. but there are also some incredible, inspiring cowbells played by some great drummers. Check out some of these ones and you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so used in the right place, the cowbell is awesome and it can be used in so many styles. And I've been searching for a great cowbell for years. I've never quite been happy with any cowbell I've ever owned. And I played, I remember one particular percussionist that I used to play with and he had this awesome cowbell and it was this beaten up, dented old thing. It did look like he'd licked it off a cow. Looked terrible, no brand name. He didn't even know where he got it from, I don't think. And I just wanted, I, I said, I'll buy it off you. I'll, name your price, this is the best thing I've ever heard. And it's just been like some elusive thing for me to find a cowbell that I loved. But finally, finally I found the cowbell and I, want, and I just want to show it today because if you're, if you're in the same sort of position I was in uh, until I found this bad boy, then hopefully this video is going to help show you the way and you could end your cowbell woes. So this is the LP229 and this cowbell, this is the one used by Dave Weckle who like, the way he brings cowbell into his grooves just is perfect, I love it. And it's also, I believe, the same cowbell that Gad uses, but he's got his signature cowbell, but I think it's basically the same cowbell, just with a, just with a, a different attachment. I think that's the only difference. So um, that's partly, when well, big part actually, what led me to give this a go. And I'm absolutely loving it. So I'm just gonna show you, so you can kind of hear it in some different, used in some different ways, so you can see what you think of this cowbell. Okay, so the first, I'm gonna show you this in a bit of a rock setting, just laying it down with some quarter notes. Now, for that, LP, um, they, and you know, probably other brands do as well, but they do have the, the ridge thing with the big plastic ridge on it where you can really hammer it home with, when you, when you just want that real cutting rock sound just to play like your quarter notes, you can go, go for those. So if that's all you're gonna do with it, you might wanna check out those types of cowbells, but this one still gives a nice solid rock sound. Now this cowbell works really, really well in that kind of Weckle, Gad, sort of Latin-esque, sort of Latin funk, jazz, fusion-y type vibe. When you just want to bring a bit of that into your groove, that's, that's where the magic happens for me with this cowbell. That's, that's where I mostly want to use it, and that's where I get excited about using a cowbell. This works really well in that setting. And of course, if you get suddenly, you know, someone points at you and says, do a drum solo, and you've suddenly got to pull a solo out of nowhere, it's never a bad thing if you've got an awesome cowbell just to chuck a little bit of color and texture and a bit of, bit of different sonic option into your solo. And this doesn't let you down in the solo setting as well.
All right, so look, this is, this is just a little glimpse into it. Um, if you love this cat, if you like the sound of it, I'll put a link below this video so you can you can link through and grab yourself one. I mean, I'm just doing this because it was such for me the the search has been got it's gone it's gone on for years, and I bought so many cowbells that haven't that haven't hit the spot for me. And you know, I could start up a cowbell shop to sell them all on, um, but. Finally, this one does everything I need a cowbell to do. So if you're in that position, you're looking for the cowbell, hopefully this video has helped you find your way to the perfect cowbell. I hope this video is helpful for you all. If you liked it, hit subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. There'll be other videos where we're looking at gear, we're teaching various drum beats, there's every, everything you need as a drummer. Hit subscribe and I'll see you next time.